Titini Tamano Tanata Tokato Now my heart of my fucking town mate Welcome in to the Tamuka Domain We're looking forward to the 2023 Heartlands Championship Between perennial favourites South Canterbury And uh, Whanganui The ball secured by Amato for South Canterbury Now Malina Thangi again slips the first tackle, nice build up from Wanganui. Josh Lane with the carry. And now they shift. Hay Horton. They're building momentum and they're advancing the ball. And they've got the benefit of the advantage, Tanoa. And Simoti in a contest for the ball. To put three points over, which he does quite comfortably, Ken, and well deserved too. Oh, nicely done by Namosi Malua with a win that line out against the throw. And now Vakarongo back on, offloads in the tackle. Tano with a right foot step throws the ball back for Seduwalu down the right edge. Wanganui first try in the Meads Cup final. Beautifully done from Wanganui. The great ball, look at that, over the top of the shoulder. On to Tomasi Surawalu, and he was never going to be stopped. Great try. In the best period of this first half. For South Canterbury, the defending champions. Looking for a three-peat as Wanganui forwards come through the middle to try to disrupt the ball. Kala, a flat ball. Oh, they've got a penalty advantage. Now South Canterbury. The big number six of Paul in hand. As we see the kick go over from Sam Briggs. So... Some points on the board for South Canterbury. Now Briggs to the line. Briggs, right hand off. Load in the middle. A little tip on for Willie Wright. And they're on the front foot again, South Canterbury. Now the pick and go. Now it's on the ground. They're a big chance from here, South Canterbury. Good defence, Josh Lane. Now the drive, the defence, short, hard and straight, South Canterbury. Referee says held up, great defence. Two more, Hone, and now Amato. G carries the ball strong, Amato. And wins a penalty. Now Sam Briggs. Very popular. Popular result for the home crowd. Inside the five metres now. And then a strong drive and South Canterbury under pressure on their own goal line. And the benefit of a penalty advantage as well for the visitors. It's Jamie Hughes. When they need to get the ball out to the left edge. Wow, with a beautiful piece of footwork. He's under the post. They have big numbers out on the left. Just kept on banging away. Jamie Hughes first up. And then this pass here. Out to Whale, the captain. Lovely left foot step. And straight under the dot. Two more Huni. Kakala with another carry. A little... Double pump, and they've opened them up. Fafita. Now they continue the attack just on the 22. Briggs, first receiver. Now Joyce. Now Zach Mackay. Two more. Huni. Dummies on the right side. Beautifully done. 
from the blind side, flanker. Two more, Huni. Beautiful try, just drawing past. Look at that, last two defenders. He made the right decision, Talma Huni. But that was just beautifully done by South Canterbury, moving the ball from one side to the other. Drawing pass, and there he is, the big man, right under the sticks, with plenty of support at the end of the ground as well. Amato now Willie right for Briggs. Briggs with a second man play, and that's Morley coming from the right wing. Willie Wright now tips the ball. Oh, telling ah on the left hand side. South Canterbury are celebrating like they've scored. The crowd are celebrating, and the officials are non two plus. <laughs> I don't think I've seen that before, Briggs. And the three points on top of that. And inside the 18-meter mark now is Fakatava has to carry the co-captain. And they've got a penalty advantage now. Kakala. Briggs on the move with an inside ball. Zach Mackay. Couldn't get the ball away in the tackle. Now the pick and go, South Canterbury. They have claimed ownership to the last 10 minutes for sure. The home team. Been absolutely superb today. Kicking, passing, running, decision making. He has been on point. They were down early in the game. Come back with a couple of converted tries to lead at half time, 23 points to 15. Good defense from South Canterbury, meeting them on the advantage line. And now South Canterbury on the counter attack straight away. Chance down the left side, Latinganga turns the ball on the inside, gets it back. What a way to open the second half. South Canterbury, class, quality, and poise. Samoti takes the ball. Beautiful pass by the big number eight, Kakala. And then Leah Tagaga just combining beautifully with Samoti. Namosi, Malua. Salu with the offload and the tackle. There a chance on this right edge. Wanganui, Seduwalu. Big carry from the second five. Horrocks for Salu. Hard and straight. He's over the line. What a try. A show of power and class. Horrocks, good run from Horrocks. And a good carry off a quick recycle. There's a penalty for taking the halfback. So that reduces the deficit to five. So it's converted to try in it. Zach Mackay. Briggs. And Kakala, again, he gets rid of the first defender, fends off the second, recycles the ball, right, Briggs. And now Ahikovi, Ahikovi with some footwork. Great run from the lock forward. Willie Wright, short ball. Now they're under the pump. Wanganui in defence, Fakatava. Seven metres out. Anderson, Anderson hard at the line, Anderson, just short the hooker, they need a quick recycle, now the pick and go, Kakala, he's flipped onto his back, and then they get through, good scrum from South Canterbury, Whale on the move with the right foot, step, Whale inside the 10, now they recycle, Vakarongo, Driven back on the advantage line. Siduwalu tips it on at that ball. It's an advantage. Wanganui, the short ball, the offload and the tackle. 
And a brilliant try for Tanoa. And they are right back in at Whanganui. At Phillips. Now they shift. Amato. Coming back, the left side, Phillips. Now the pick and go, oh. South Canterbury. That should be enough to get the job done for South Canterbury. The ground security here is outstanding as well. <laughs> <laughs> the crowd are on their feet. Well, there's still time to go. Still plenty, five minutes to go. As we see, Phillips just taking the ball up. Did the right thing, hung on to the ball. Not sure who's the man that went over. Classen. Oh, that's a play on. This could be a try for South Canterbury. It's full time here. They have won for the third consecutive occasion. South Canterbury, the Meads Cup. A game of controversy and drama, but also a defining piece, a defining moment in the history of our game. Very rare do we see three peats. Well, outstanding effort from Whanganui as well. They came down here and threw the kitchen sink at the South Canterbury side. You've got to admire the way they played this match. Their defence at times was just magnificent, but just not probably taking a couple of the advantages or chances in South Canterbury, 40 points to 30.